Hello friends, hope you're well and I'm back with another video that is about bottle cap decor ideas. So it's not every day you see someone collect bottle caps for a DIY project but there are in fact plenty of fun and interesting bottle cap art ideas. And we are really excited to have a look at some in this video. So number one is boxy bottle cap table. For the project featured on, you will need a whole bunch of bottle caps. The idea here is to glue them onto a table to cover the whole top. Depending on how big the table is, you can calculate how many caps you will need. After you figure out the design and pattern, you need to put a layer of epoxy onto the table surface. Put the caps on top and let the epoxy dry. Then apply another layer over the caps. Number two is IKEA bottle cap table. A similar project is also featured and it is uh, in this case an IKEA lag side table was used but you can pretty much use any table you want. Perhaps You'd like to give an old table a makeover. In any case, you will need a lot of bottle caps, and some play wood, heavy duty adhesive, a glue gun, nails, a saw, paint, tap, kraut, a bucket, a sponge, screws, and screwdriver. Then number three is bottle cap and chime. You would also need a quite a few bottle caps to make a bin chime, especially if you want it to look like the one in the picture. You will need something to attach all these caps to and that something can be anything from any empty can to a colander or a box. Attach your bottle cap chains to it and make the chime as long as full as you want. Then um, there are you can made of course not all the products we found require large amount of bottle caps. For some of them you only need a few caps for example Check out tea light candle after you pour wax in it. Don't forget the wick. Then there is a bottle cap garden art. Take the fun out in the garden and make some lovely bottle cap garden art. You will need several metal bottles, caps, but floors as well as wooden squares, some paint, some paint brush and glue. Arrange the caps face down the form and flower and then hot glue them together after that glue the square to the back of the floor then the glue is cool and try paint the floor so this is all about today's video i hope so you like this and do tell us from where you're watching our video we would like to thank you subscribe our channel and